Hey guys, thanks for joining me for another wonderful math question. Uh, we're looking at the uh, grade 7 Gauss paper now, and we're all the way up to question number 7. Karen has just been chosen the new math idol. A total of 1,480,000 votes were cast, and Karen received 83% received of them. How many people voted for her? Okay, so usually I try and avoid using my calculator, but it wouldn't be so bad to, to do it on this one. I'll show you why. We need 83% uh, of them. There's lots of ways we can go about approaching this, depending on how comfortable you are with percents. But in general, something percent, so 83% of some amount, is the same, you can't multiply percents or anything like that, Percents are measured out of a total of 100. 100% is the maximum amount. So we can change 83% of into a multiplication, and that's something we can do. Okay. Now, if you're very comfortable with percents, you'll already be able to make this connection, like 90% is 0.9, 46% is 0.46, that sort of thing. So if you, you, you don't need to write down your solutions of this one, so if you just want to jump to it and grab it on your calculator, that's fine. But uh, this, I would probably grab my calculator for, and that's exactly what I'm going to do. I try and avoid them when I can, but, uh, you know, large calculation, that's why they allow calculators. So, got to be careful typing in 1480000 multiplied by 0.83. So, I'm looking at uh, 1 million, I'm just going to write it down, 1,228,400. Okay, so this is the number that I need to find. And it doesn't take too long, there's only five answers. We see it's B. Okay, and that about does it for question number seven. We could have, as I, I do try and avoid calculator, we could have done this by hand. You know, we could have set up a, a little something like uh, 1480000, 0.83. Kept decimals in there, multiplied it out by hand, but given the amount of numbers, it's actually uh, faster just to grab your calculator. So I always encourage you guys save time where you can, and if you're good with a calculator, you can set this up. You you might not have even needed to write anything down. Anyway, that does it for question seven. Uh, we look forward to question number eight, and I look forward to sharing question eight with you in the next video. So thanks for watching. Feel free to like or subscribe or anything else. I'll see you guys in the next video.